Hey Team Shuckle, what is up? Welcome back to another episode of Double Trouble. As you can see right down below, we are doing another Link battle. This one's actually going to be live, and this is for the Pokemon Doubles League PDL sh for short. It's 6v6 doubles, which sort of follows Smogon rules, but um, a few of our own rules thrown in because when we made it I was not aware that Smogon doubles was a little bit different than Smogon overused but oh well so today we're battling uh, the average Joe um, both of us have perfect records so far in the in the league however he is at the top of the league because he has somehow managed to 3-0 every single person so far so i'm actually quite nervous for this battle i'm gonna hit battle start i'm gonna choose my battle box and we're gonna get this battle going um i'm actually pretty nervous because no matter what happens here it's gonna break someone is gonna lose their perfect streak and uh i don't know who wants to lose it and it's true i mean it could really go any way and that's the scary part so he's gonna be bringing scrafty houndoom suicune Venusaur, Talonflame, and Honchkrow. Now, I brought Charizard because I knew Charizard would be the one, would be the play for this battle. Um, so I'm going to start off with Charizard. As you can see, everything but that Scrafty is hit super effectively. So it is fan freaking tastic that I bring it. Um, but that does leave the Scrafty, which I'm not entirely sure who to start with. Um, I'm going to suggest bringing... Raichu, who I didn't change. I forgot to change its move pool. No, wait. Did I give it? Wait, hold on. We will see. I don't remember if I changed it. I didn't change it. God dang it. I have a Thunder Raichu on a Sun Team. Thank the heavens. Um, and then the order doesn't matter from there because it is 6v6. Um, actually, ooh. Nah, it's too late. Well, I'm going to say, well, damn. <laughs> Wrong right you. <laughs> this is going to be awkward. Um, the good thing about the Raichu being there is that the flying coverage that I would need Raichu to provide actually is provided by the um, Charizard with Ancient Power. So I'm not too worried about that. Now, the rule of this league is that when you have... A, um, a mega you have to mega evolve it before the game is over um, so I mean I'm gonna mega evolve my my beautiful Charizard here uh, the question is do I want to go for that Venusaur no you know what, what I'm gonna do I am going to ancient power the Scooby Doom the Houndoom and I think I'm gonna fake oh where's fake out okay there it is okay I almost hit it HP ice that would have been terrible and I'm gonna fake out the Venusaur this way it doesn't get a good boost on me um, it's not mega so it will be chlorophyll and I don't have anything to take sleep powder or do I I should have left safety goggles on my hydrogon for my team I should have totally done that and I didn't that was silly I forgot he had Venusaur that had... I looked at his team, too, and I was like, there's nothing here that can put me to sleep. I don't need safety goggles. I'm wrong! Oh, he's gonna protect. No! He's gonna protect. Okay. Um, oh, they're both gonna protect. Okay, okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Uh, the good news about that is I do have... Focus Blast. Now, will, will, will Focus Blast KO this, this Scooby-Doo? Um... Hmm. Venusaur is fast. Venusaur is definitely pretty fast. I'm going to assume he is going to try and put the um, the Charizard to sleep. That That is my guess because the Charizard is probably the biggest threat to his team. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to protect here. And um, I am going to Focus Blast the Houndoom. Now, I, I honestly doubt I'll survive a fire, a flamethrower even from this, this uh, Houndoom, but it, it can't hurt to try. And, oh wow, I avoid the attack. It looks like he wasn't actually going for the Charizard, so hopefully the uh, Houndoom's attack was in fact going for the Charizard. Um, I do not pick up that kill on the Houndoom, however, the Solar Power will kill it. Um, it what was that? Was that Solar Beam? Did he really go for Solar Beam? I guess predicting um, a switch into something else. Um, but he did miss the, the sleep powder, which is very unfortunate for him. Um, he actually said, sleep powder, why you always miss? And, uh, ugh! I don't know. Um, but this, this fast, fast Venusaur is going to be quite the issue. 
but um, honestly, my Raichu really isn't... I, I'm really surprised as to why he targeted the Raichu when the Charizard really does have the quite the advantage against his team, but we'll have to see. I guess HP Ice is something that's obvious. Uh, Focus Blast is not something that I see very often, but this was for my Rain team, which I didn't have anything specifically for. Okay, you're going to fake something out. What are you going to fake out? Eh, you know what? It doesn't matter if you fake anything out. I'm just going to go for the Heat Wave, which will do damage, and I'm going to go for HP Ice against the uh, Venusaur, because the Venusaur really is the biggest threat on his team for me right now. Uh, Venusaur is always one of those Pokemon that I have a huge issue trying to beat. Um, so I'm assuming... Okay, yeah, Charizard, are you going to put me to sleep? That's the question. No, you're putting the Raichu to sleep. Okay, that's that's an interesting thing. Um, I'm actually completely fine with the Raichu being put to sleep, like I said already. Um, I do have my Charizard. I'm really actually quite surprised as to why he didn't uh, target the Charizard with that. But what I'm going to do here is, um, looking at his team, looking at his team, I think I'm going to bring Cresselia. Uh, and Cresselia can handle fighting, Cresselia can handle pretty much anything Venusaur wants to throw my way, and um, it can help me. Now, I do have Trick Room on this Cresselia, it's, it's really not supposed to. Uh, this is not even close to being a Trick Room team, although <laughs> looking at what I brought it could very easily pass for Trick Room. But um, he is going to go for Protect with the Venusaur, which I am completely fine with. Um, I'm gonna go for Heat Wave. It's gonna hit, hopefully. It does hit the Scrafty. Um, the Venusaur really doesn't have too much against me right now. Um, it's gonna go for Rock Tomb. Very interesting. Um, I, wow, that, that's, oh, crit. Okay, that makes sense. Surprisingly, that did KO me. It probably should not have, considering Rock Tomb is about base 60, which is about the base power of a spread Rock Slide. I think it's just the five base power stronger. Um, so that's unfortunate, but the good news is I do also still have more fire moves on my team. I do have Rotom Heat, and I do also have this very beautiful, very lovely, um, Hydreigon. So what I'm going to do now is I am going to Flamethrower. I did not take a picture of this guy's team. Why do I never do that? I need to learn to do that. Well, you know what? The good news about that is I played in 4th gen when there was no team preview, so I'm still pretty decent at guessing what could happen. Um, in the sun, nothing really... Wait, it is still sunny, right? What turn is this? I, I really wish they had a turn counter. I don't think... Oh yeah, it is still sunny. I can see that. Alright, and I'm going to Moonblast the Scrafty, because I can take a crunch if I need to. I definitely can. Um, oh, he's asking me if Sleep Claws. I should answer that. Yes. Um... Yeah, there, there is a sleep clause. Um, what we're going to probably do for next season is ask if people want to do VGC or smoke on doubles and actually use those rule sets instead of doing some convoluted rule set that we made up. <laughs> so um, he's going to go for Giga Drain, which really should not do very much at all. Uh, we're going to get the flamethrower off. Um, that should kill it. It does. fan frickin tastic I am very happy with that. And I'm hoping the Scrafty does not go for Drain Punch. Oh, it's... Oh, I'm faster than it. Uh, I forget how slow Scrafty is sometimes. I mean, considering this is a Trick Room Cresselia, which, again, it should not be. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, cool. So we probably have, like, one more turn of Sun left, which sort of sucks, but... Outside of Charizard, which I really did want for the rest of his team, um, not too much. I really wish that Rock Tomb didn't cl crit. I would have switched out anyway the next turn because um, the speed lowered. Actually, the speed lowered wouldn't have made me lose to Scrafty, would it have? No. So Okay, so you're bringing in Shuicune and what elf? Elf. Elf. <laughs> and that thing. What can that thing do? Suicune is probably a Crocoon, which is Rest, Sleep Talk, um, Calm Mind, and Scald. So, or it probably has Ice Beam. It probably has Ice Beam. But, yeah, I really don't know what Suicune's run, and I don't know what a Honchkrow does. What does a Honchkrow do? They have superpower, I guess, right? They do have superpower. 
They do get superpower. Is it faster than me, though? I don't really remember my EV spread. Um, I think I do have protect, so I'm just going to go for protect here. And I am going to... Um, should I trick room? Nah, I'm going to Moonblast the uh, Honchkro, just in case, you know. Um, I'm curious to see what is going to happen. It might protect itself, which would kind of suck. Um, okay, so you're going to Scald. It's not protecting, so... I'm going to assume that I'm... Oh, he predicted me. Good job. Um, I'm going to assume... Yeah, okay, so... I'm going to assume you're slower than me. That does not do nearly enough damage. Um, Night Slash coming in will probably kill me. So, hmm, what to do, what to do. I do still have my Metagross in the back, which could easily, well, not easily, but it can handle the Suicune pretty well. Um, he has, what does he have in the back? I don't remember. Why did I go Scottish there? That didn't make sense. Was that even good? I don't even know if that was, I'm terrible at accents. Oh, geez. Okay, um, this Honchkrow, you know what? I'm going to go under the assumption that I will outspeed this Honchkrow and kill it with Dark Pulse. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to... I'm going to switch out. What do I have? I'm going to switch out into... Should I go into Raichu? Raichu could be pretty useful. Um, Could it? Can it, can it, can it? No, because I definitely want to keep Cresselia alive for helping hand boosts. So I'm going to sack off Raichu. I don't want to lose Cresselia. Just in case I don't actually outspeed this thing. Um, judging by the damage, it would have killed me. So we'll see. I'm, I'm hoping he double attacks me. Oh, he goes for Sucker Punch onto my Hydreigon. I should probably take that. Yeah, I can take that pretty Not as well as I hoped. Um, but the Dragon Pulse will kill it, hopefully. Hopefully. Yes. Yes! Alright, that was a big threat to the remainder of my team. Um, Life Orb. Uh, Ice Beam? Ice Beam. Is that going to kill me? That's probably going to kill me. Really? Fantastic. I did not expect that not to kill me. <laughs> cool. Um, so your last Pokemon is that thing. Oh. 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 I do have my Metagross. I do have my Rotom. So here's the thing. I'm going to have to take out the Talonflame. But how am I going to do that? I only have Thunder. Well, I'm going to fake out first. Uh, so let's see how that does. Hopefully I wake up. If I don't wake up, this is going to be very awkward. Um, I'm, I'm like... A little weary of this talent flame. I woke up! Oh, if I knew that, I would have attacked you, you jerk! <laughs> Oops. Um, you're gonna scald my Raichu. Please, baby, survive. You did, my baby. You got burnt, though! What is wrong with you, Raichu? <laughs> oh, that is gonna be a problem. That is gonna be a problem. Okay, um... I'm going to have to take a risk here. You know what? No, no I'm not. No I'm not. I'm just going to I'm going to Dragon Pulse the Suicune. I'm going to lose my Hydreigon, but I'm going to thunder the right uh, the Talonflame and we're going to hope that it hits. I think it's only like 70 accuracy, so it's going to be pretty it's going to be very risky, but I'm really hoping because I don't I'd rather Oh, hello. Okay. That's not what I thought you'd do. Um, so I mean I lose both of them this turn. That sort of sucks. Um, I should have probably atta double attacked the Talonflame. I guess he predicted me to switch out, which is fair enough, you know. I do survive, though. I mean, he's gonna kill me with the Ice Beam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so what do I have? What do I have for this thing? Do I have anything? Um... What did I give my Rotom Heat? Let's see what I gave my Rotom Heat. Check moves. Um, Volt Switch. Why do you have Volt Switch? Oh, that is so wrong. Okay. Um, actually, that's actually not too bad. That's not too bad. That's not too bad, actually. Okay. I, I can I can take this I can take this home. I think. I think I can take this home right here. 
what do I what I need to do is I'm gonna lose my Cresselia to Brave Birds, so I need to Helping Hand boost my Rotom. Go for Volt Switch. Okay, so Helping Hand boost the Rotom. Go for Volt Switch. Do I want to do it onto the? What do I have left? I have Metagross in the back. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do it to the Talon Flame. Helping Hand boost the Rotom. Lose the Cresselia to Brave Bird. Taunt. Okay, that's funny. That worked. Um, and then Volt Switch into Metagross to take the Scald. Yes. Yes! Now, it's probably gonna burn me, which would suck. <laughs> but, like, I do have that the helping hand boost. I'm already choice banded, so it's still gonna hurt like a truck. And I do have that Rotom in the back, who is in fact faster than this um, Suicune. So hopefully that works. Hopefully we can 3-0 him like he 3-0s everyone else. That would be funny. I would love that. Um, so let's go for it. I'm gonna helping hand boost it. He didn't burn us, so that's good. Um, he's probably gonna kill the Cresselia this turn, but I'm still gonna go for the helping hand boost. Um, Cause that. Oh, I can't do it. Okay, um, I guess we're gonna go for Psy Shock onto the Suicune, and Zen Headbutt onto the Suicune, and that should be enough. I don't really know the defensive prowess of a Suicune. Um, it's gonna go for Skull probably onto the Cresselia. Yep, and it doesn't kill. Fantastic! It does burn the Cresselia, but I really do think this should be enough. Choice Banded Zen Headbutt, if it doesn't miss, of course. Oh, that does nothing. You are so defensive. I take that back. Oh my god. Oh my god, you're so defensive. Oh, that was scary. Um, if he burns my Metagross, that's kind of game right there. Or, or that's kind of, um, I can't, I can't get a 3-0 there. Um, but you're gonna Scald the Cresselia again, which would really suck, but you know what? I'm gonna go for it. Actually, I'm gonna go for Moon. Nah, actually, but by the HP range. I really wanted to get, um, Psychic on this thing. That would have been a little bit nicer for this match, but hey, that's fine. We only lose Cresselia so far. Um, the Rotom, if Zen Pad Headbutt does miss, Rotom is faster than this Suicune, so that's all that matters. Doesn't miss, and it kills! Fantastic! Good game. Really wanted to 3-0 the 3-0 man. Er, yeah, I typed that wrong. All right, so that was the game. Um, God, I'm so relieved that I get to keep my undefeated victory so far. Because um, <laughs> he is technically the um, the best in the league right now. Because while we, like I said, up until this match, we did have the exact same um, uh, score, like three zero um he won every single battle three oh and most of my battles were two oh or one oh so it would have been nice to three oh the guy who never has never ending three o's but I, i'm still grateful for the win um that was a very very awesome battle i'm glad you guys watched it live i usually do them post narration because uh, I prefer to concentrate on it, but I was actually literally about to sit down and do a recording and he messaged me on Skype and was like, hey, you ready for our battle? And I was like, you know what? I'm going to do it. So I went for it. I need to change that Raichu. Um, I probably won't. I'll probably just clone it because I'm using that Raichu on my rain team. So that's what I got for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace.